right, folks. Well, the mailman came today and brought a little package, and uh, I thought I would share it with you guys. I told you I was, in one of my other videos I was going to be getting some more micros, and this is the first one that's come in so far. It is uh, an Orlando Hunter is what it's called. Or you can reference this number if you're searching on Google, but it is a... You can see cell phone size rock crawler. And see how cell, cell phone is spelled wrong there? That's kind of neat. <laughs> so 135th scale. Uh, don't know a whole lot about it. It looks to be most of the instructions are in Chinese. Japanese. Something. I really don't know. I'm um, hoping the manual has an English version. If not, it, I hope it has at least some very detailed pictures. You can get this kit uh, for around 60 65 bucks on online. Uh, it ships out from Hong Kong. And it's just a tiny, tiny version of a real one-tenth or a real one-one scale crawler uh, truck a Ford. Let me show you. I got. I ordered these along with it. Uh, we'll see if you can. Orlando Hunter. Orlando. That's a little micro speed control. Uh, it does have a lighting LED lighting for front and rear lights. Uh, in here. And this was. I want to think around ten bucks when you buy the truck. Maybe a little less. But hopefully it works good. A little speed control. Here is another piece that I had gotten for it. This is a servo, a steering servo. And if you can see just how big it is, my, I can cover it with my thumb. Uh, it's a very tiny micro servo. So I'm sure it's all plastic gears and all that kind of good stuff. A little micro plug here. So it's going to be very intricate work to put these things in there's that okay let's see what else. oh here's the motor that comes with it it's a little geared motor you can see it in here same brand uh, I got this on Banggood and that was pretty cheap they offered a little uh, package that they discounted some of these accessories because it comes the standalone kit here comes uh, with just the kit. You still need all your electronics, motor, and everything to make it actually RC. Uh, so let me get the tape off. Let me cut some of this, and we'll see what we got here. Oh, I'll just include y'all in on the on the opening. Let me cut her open here. See if I can get it get it started. Oh, maybe. some tape here all right uh, nice little packaging the packaging is pretty nice little box slim let's see what we got here first off you have your manual let's take a look inside to see whether it is in any English or not. No, nope. it looks to be all Chinese to me. Let's see, but at least it's really. I guess these are some tools that are included here. It seems to be very detailed diagrams, so I'm sure that I can figure this out. Um, but if you're inexperienced with you know RC kits this may be a barrier um, you know to get in this vehicle if you it's very intricate tiny parts I'm assuming that this is going to be harder than one of the one tenth scale builds so and like I say it's not it's everything's in Chinese so I'm just going to have to look at the pictures and see what parts we need here like these and then match it up on the diagrams and hope it works out 
And I'm going to do a little video uh, while I'm building it. I may not do, you know, the whole build of all the boring little stuff, but the main parts I'm going to try to get and put it on here just for anybody else that, you know, is building one of these and can't read Chinese. So, that's the book. We spent enough time looking at that. Let's see, let's see what's in here. I don't, got some little foams. Here's the little rubber tires here. And these are the foams back here. They feel pretty soft, very soft. And there's also some rims right here. Tiny. You can see I can cover those with my thumb as well. Two of them with one thumb. So very tiny stuff we're working with here. Let's see what else. This looks like the tub part of the chassis. Maybe some gears right there. See those gears. Maybe some differential gears. Uh, let's see the bags are all clearly labeled C so that'll help with putting it together even though it's all in another language oh yeah here is the body shell hard plastic let's see I'm gonna have to take this out on camera just to, just to show you guys here let's see what we got body I'll just leave all these little pieces in there hopefully right, let me check this out windshield and moonroof which is cool I didn't notice, even notice that online that it had a moonroof anyway let's get to looking at this thing hooks together looks like pretty simply but I don't want to do anything, I don't know about it yet, so, pretty good, uh, F-150 body, I think I'm going to use a white and gold paint scheme on this, I'm not sure yet, but that's what I was planning on doing, but I just, I really like that it's hard body, um, it's kind of like, once again, kind of like the one tenth scale crawlers. Let's see, looks like we got a bag, another parts bag of just different things. Little looks like little shock adjustments. Uh oh. Take these out little drive shafts. Little drive shafts here. It's almost like not even big as a pencil around. Oh, <laughs> uh, here's some little springs, shock springs and stuff. Let's see what else we got here. Oh, looks like rods, metal rods and rod ends in this bag. And that'll be for your steering and your four link suspension. Oh, looks like they included a little bag of tools. A little screwdriver. Looks like a little hand, a little hand drill. Which is really neat because I heard that you uh, do have to drill drill some holes in this to get everything to fit up. So that's another reason I'm assuming that it's so cheap. But it's, that's awesome that they give it to you and included in the kit. Um, because I'm sure using a drill on these tiny parts would be very risky on these tiny little parts like this. So nice little bonus little phillips head screwdriver in here as well to use it to put together because uh i don't even know yeah you could probably get a, a glasses screwdriver for that little fit but it's nice they included it in there something else i can't even i don't even know what this little jar of stuff is but we'll see what's in there later Oh, I do like this. They included bearings with the kit right here. Bearings, you got your metal. Uh, metal, some more metal axles here. Oh, and some transmission components. Metal transmission components. But the gears, the gears are, are plastic. This is bag A. And like I say, I'm going to put a vi video of uh, the build and all that on here. And show you guys exactly 
how hard or how easy it is to build one of these little kits uh, doing some of the work that you have to do by hand and with just the parts being so tiny so uh, just stay tuned we will have more videos of this truck coming up like I said I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna do the white with gold paint scheme and this is just one of the minis uh, that I have coming I have another on the way and also a little drone that's coming on the way all from Banggood so I'll be doing unboxings and then I will do reviews um, of these and I will do a build video of this truck here being it's a kit version and it's uh, it's just something neat it's something different you can it's very scale it looks like a one-tenth uh, truck just scaled down micro size it's pretty neat it's gonna be see be neat to see how it all goes together see how it performs once it's completed anyway stay tuned for more videos like